Imagine this, real life horror stories so chilling, they'll keep you up at night. Let's dive right in. Number 10, the Dyatlov Pass Incident. In 1959, nine experienced hikers mysteriously died in the Ural Mountains. Their tent was cut open from the inside and they fled into the freezing cold, barely dressed. What drove them out? We still don't know. Moving to number nine, the Island of the Dolls. In Mexico, an island is adorned with decaying dolls, a tribute to a young girl who drowned there. Locals say the dolls move and whisper, making it a place you wouldn't want to visit alone. Number eight, the Winchester Mystery House. Sarah Winchester, heiress to the Winchester Rifle Fortune, built a labyrinthine mansion to confuse the spirits of those killed by her family's guns. With staircases leading to nowhere and doors opening to walls, it's a house that defies logic. Number seven, the Amityville Horror. In 1974, the Lutz family moved into a house where a mass murder had occurred. They fled after 28 days, claiming paranormal activity drove them out. The house remains icon of real life horror. Number six, the Enfield Poltergeist. In the 1970s, a family in England reported furniture moving, strange noises, and even physical attacks by an unseen force. The events were so terrifying, they inspired the movie The Conjuring 2. Number 5, Bell Witch Haunting. In the early 1800s, the Bell family in Tennessee was tormented by a spirit known as the Bell Witch. The entity was said to pull hair, slap faces, and even speak. Legend lives on inspiring countless retellings. Number four, the Perron family haunting, the real life inspiration behind The Conjuring. The Perron family experienced a decade of terror in their Rhode Island farmhouse. Doors slammed, voices whispered, and apparitions appeared, making their lives a living nightmare. Number three, the Annalise Michelle exorcism. 1976, a young German woman underwent a series of exorcisms to rid her of demons. The ordeal lasted months, and Annalise eventually died from malnutrition and dehydration. Her story is a chilling tale of faith and tragedy. Number two, the Hinterkaifeck murders. In 1922, a family and their maid were brutally murdered on a remote farm in Germany. The killer was never found, and the motive remains a mystery. The farm's isolation and the gruesome details make it a haunting story. And finally, Number one, Zodiac Killer. A serial killer who terrorized Northern California in the late 1960s and early 1970s, the Zodiac Killer sent taunting letters to the press, claiming responsibility for numerous murders. Despite extensive investigations, the killer was never caught, leaving a chilling legacy of unsolved crimes. These real life horror stories are more than just tales. They're reminders that sometimes truth is stranger and more terrifying than fiction.